welcome to Iceland Bay. It is good to see you all. As you can see, Fluffy and I have moved. Look how happy he is with his new place. And I'm not going to take him on our walk today, but just know that most of the things you see are of course supervised by Fluffy. I chose this spot because at one side I can look over the sea and the future pirate bay and at the other side as you can see in a little bit when I walk down this incline city center well not really city but I think it's nice I made this comfy corner to start telling stories when I do my updates with fairy tales my neighbors really are enjoying this little main street and I'm enjoying it too I get some piano practice in and I know I'm not very good but I'm getting it in still a little bit bare behind the buildings but I am starting to grow some trees to put up there I want to see how it looks when the trees are in the size I want them so I have a little place where I grow the trees I will show that place to you in a little bit I think my little main street turned out really cute and um, if we ever get Brewster before I'm done with all this I still have a little bit of space I also want to talk to you about a problem I have it's not a very big problem or at least I don't think it's a very big problem but some people are telling me that I have basically a big problem and it's called hoarding. See? Tons and tons of bushes. And a lot of flowers still. And I have to be honest, I already got rid of about two thirds of my flowers. So what you're seeing here is about one third of the flowers I used to have. I know my friends really are telling me that I have a big problem. But I guess I should be a little bit more careful how I take care of my flowers, but I can't just I can't just let them go. I have a hard time of throwing them away and oh well, it's a problem. But the same friends who are telling me that I have a hoarding problem are helping me with my next hoarding problem. But this is a useful hoard. This hoard of musk stools is going to be a big part of my build. And for those who are ever in the Efteling will recognize them immediately. The music from these musk stools in the Efteling is a very pretty little song, a menuet in G. And a lot of people thought that it was written by Bach. But in the 70s they found out that it was by Christian Petzold and he was a house friend of Bach. The info about this, of course, down in the description. As you can see, I have been really working hard on my terraforming. Most of my island will be second and third level. And it's a lot of work. Here you can see my little cove. Well, maybe not that little, but it's for the pirates. With a lot of gold and palm trees and well, whatever a pirate loves to steal. For those who have 
watched my other videos, you will recognize my little haunted house. Sweet little Lucky is home today, but I'm not going to bother him. I'm bringing him a gift later. As I said, I will has have been uh, terraforming. Of course, I played around a little bit, just filling up the island with rows and rows and rows of cliffs. Can get a bit boring, but it is mostly what I have been doing. Second tier, third. This place I have reserved for my next build, and it's Drago's Dragon Lair with his hoard of gold. It's a good spot, it's nice and high, he can keep an eye on the pirates that they won't come and steal his gold. Pirates are of course not to be trusted and a good dragon knows. Already prepared some spaces to put the trees. to have a little fuse. Part of what I've been doing is looking at my map and staring out into the distance. I pretend I'm working at that moment. Pathing have has to come. Still checking if what I made is giving me the views that I want. Here I do realize that I need more trees also uh, around the haunted mansion. Well, most of this is going to be. third level and here I will be planting trees and trees and bushes and more trees and bushes and probably even more trees and that's our little round around the island Hamlet being cute. Well, that's it for today. It's not a long video. It's not really much yet, but I'm happy with it and it will start looking like a forest soon because I have places now to move my neighbors and to put the fairy tales I want to do. So goodbye and for now I'm letting you enjoy the cuteness that is Hamlet. Thank you for watching, till next time, doo doo!